Now at four, a dangerous scare in the air. An off-duty Alaskan Airlines pilot now under arrest accused of trying to intentionally crash a passenger jet bound for California. Good afternoon. This is the KTLA 5 News at 4. I'm Pedro Rivera. And I'm Samantha Cortese. Authorities say that pilot was riding in an extra seat inside the cockpit when he tried to shut down the jet's engines mid-flight. The jet was headed to San Francisco but made an emergency landing in Portland where the 44-year-old off-duty pilot is now being held. KTLA Sarah Wells joins us live from John Wayne Airport with what we have learned so far. Sarah. Hi, Pedro and Sam. Good afternoon. We're outside John Wayne Airport where we spoke to an aviation expert earlier today about this close call and significant security threat. Investigators are digging into the man's background to figure out why this commercial pilot would try to take down this jet midair. Horizon's making an emergency landing ETA four minutes. That's air traffic control as Horizon, the commuter airline for Alaska Airlines, makes an emergency landing. The jump seat pilot, who is the extra pilot, they, they give a ride, trying to shut down the engines. That Alaska Airlines pilot, 44-year-old Joseph Emerson, now facing 83 counts of attempted murder. Just uh, give you a heads up. We've got the uh, guy that tried to shut the engines down uh, out of the cockpit. This is really the craziest thing I remember in a long, long time, uh, and it's very sad that this was basically an in inside job. Ross Amer, a retired United Airlines pilot and CEO of Aero Consulting Experts, has flown in the cockpit jump seat numerous times. Which is a privilege allowed airline pilots. It's very strict, uh, under strict rules and regulations. Uh, and background checks. And that off-duty pilot passed those checks on the flight from Everett, Washington to San Francisco Sunday night. Amer says this is what the cockpit looks like, the jump seat behind the two pilots. The red tabs above are the fire handles that the FAA says the man attempted to deploy to shut the engines down. Had he done that, it would have been disastrous. The pilots did the perfect job because we're trained to take the danger uh, the threat out of the cockpit. Somehow the crew was able to remove the man from the flight deck as the flight safely diverted to Portland. A neighbor of the suspect is in disbelief. Doesn't sound like Joe at all. I don't know what happened to him mentally that he would do something like that. Obviously the pilots, if you listen to it, they were calm and cool and they had the situation under control. The team acted absolutely flawlessly. And thankfully, nobody got hurt. Amber does predict the privilege of pilots getting to ride in that jump seat will be going away for safety reasons. Sam, we'll send it back to you.